Hi, I'm Jo from JH Leather, and in this video, we're talking all about my newest machine in the workshop, the Glowforge Pro. So if you saw my last video on the new acrylic template that I am offering, then you will have seen that I have a new machine in the workshop in the form of the Glowforge Pro 3D laser printer, and I am super excited to see what I can make from this beast of a machine. Now, I've only had this machine for about two weeks, but so far I am super impressed with the results that I have already got from it and the machine was actually super easy to get set up and get using. So there is a guide online that you follow that takes you through each step to get you printing as soon as possible. And when it does come to the usability, it is actually really easy to use and get to grips with, especially when I compare it to my sewing machine, which I will actively avoid using because I haven't got to grips with it yet. Now the Glowforge opens up a world of opportunity. And for me, the main pull is the speed, precision and repeatability that the machine offers as me. So I can take my designs that I've created on Adobe Illustrator and print this out and get testing within a few minutes rather than going through the hassle of creating paper patterns manually and then cutting them out only to find that I wasn't as accurate as I thought and my patterns are on the wonk and I have to start everything all over again. So this is where the repeatability comes in. So once I have my design finished, I can literally print out however many I want. And I know that each one is gonna be symmetrical and identical, and I'm not gonna to have to worry about anything like that. So when it comes to my uses, for me, prototyping is just the start of what I have planned. So within the leather craft specific area, I'm able to create some awesome DIY kits and acrylic templates alongside the prototyping of new products. And it isn't just there, so this Glowforge can score, engrave and cut a whole host of materials. So when I'm not using it for my leather specific items, I'm actually going to be creating key rings and doing engraved coasters and that sort of thing for my partner's business, as well as hopefully other businesses in the area when I can get more designs created. As you can see, the footprint of the Glowforge is both quite large and quite small. When you think about what the machine can actually do, and you are going to need a way to vent the exhaust fumes that come out of the machine. So it comes supplied with a vent and you can easily put this out the window or you can use the Glowforge air filter like what I have here. Now at the moment this is working really well for me but in the future I am going to look for a way that I can vent it out of the window because I do find that the air filter is quite noisy. One of the really smart things about this Glowforge is that they have this handy camera within the machine. Now what that does is it will show you the material in your printer but it will also read the QR codes on proof grade materials and will automatically select the appropriate settings. Now it also means that you can easily lay out your designs onto your chosen material because you can actually see it within the machine. Now for my leather DIY kits and my prototyping, I'm using my own leather and the cutting settings can easily be tweaked within the Glowforge app to get the desired outcome. And they can also be saved as presets, so you won't need to keep having to manually change these every time you want to print. Now you can see that the proof grade material supplied by Glowforge comes with this masking attached to the material. And what that does is actually protects it when the Glowforge is cutting or engraving, and it will stop score marks appearing on your final product and just make everything a lot neater. So if you are using your own materials, they're obviously not gonna have this masking. And now unfortunately, Glowforge doesn't sell their own brand of masking, which should actually be really helpful. But what I have been using is the eco packing tape that I have here in the workshop. And it's working really well with the tests that I've done so far, and it's not damaging the surface of the material at all. If you are interested in purchasing a machine for yourself, whether it be for leather craft or for another business, there are three models to choose from. Now they are all the same physical size and with a rough printable area of 11 by 19 and a half inches but the pro version that I have here has this pass-through stuff which is going to be able to let you create items that are an infinite amount long 
Now, I haven't actually used this feature just yet, but for larger templates, it is something that I will be using in the future. Another difference between the models is the speed at which they can print. So the Pro is obviously the top of the range one, which can print the fastest, and it's also going to be able to print all day, unlike the two other models that they have to offer. Now, these machines are quite expensive, but one of the great things that Glowforge offer is a referral code. Now, what that is, is a two-way code. You are able to offer money off a machine, but you will also get that same amount to use as credits to purchase materials, but you can also get that converted into cash, which can be deposited into your bank account. So if you are interested in purchasing a Glowforge for yourself, then I have linked my referral code in the description and where you will be able to save up to $500 or equivalent off your purchase. Now, for those of you that are in the UK, Glowforge is available within the UK. So you're not gonna to need to worry about any import fees or anything like that, and delivery is actually pretty fast. So my final thoughts on the Glowforge for now are that for me, this is an excellent addition to the workshop, and it's gonna help me diversify my business by offering premium templates and DIY kits, as well as open up a whole new area that I can also branch into. Now, that is where I'm gonna leave it. So as I said, if you are interested in purchasing a Glowforge, my referral link is in the description. So thank you very much for watching. If you liked the video, please click the thumbs up button and subscribe for more videos and tutorials, and I shall see you in the next video.